Hello, welcome to The Raw Report. This Friday, one of the defense attorneys for the two men who shot and killed Ahmaud Aubrey apologized for his comments before a judge, where he disparaged the presence of black pastors and civil rights leaders who made themselves present in the courtroom. Now he's doubling down. On Monday, attorney Kevin Goff objected to the presence of Reverend Jesse Jackson. Take a look at the PBS NewsHour footage. Um, but I don't know who Mr. Jackson, Reverend Jackson is pastoring here. Um, my understanding is, and I, I was given names, that uh, the Arbery family have local pastors. They also have attorneys. Mr. Arbery, Marcus, has a team of lawyers to comfort him through these proceedings. Certainly, Ms. Cooper has been amply comforted by her legal counsel. Uh, and we are concerned about whether it's conscious or unconscious the impact of their presence with respect to the jury and with respect to the proceedings in this case. And I guess the next question is, which pastor is next? Is Raphael Warnock going to make it be the next person appearing this afternoon? We don't know. Your Honor, I would submit, with all respect to the Reverend Jesse Jackson, that this is no different than bringing in police officers or uniformed prison guards in a small town where a young black man has been accused of assaulting a law enforcement officer or corrections officer. And I have, as I have noted before, the city of Brunswick is indeed a fishbowl. Your Honor, I understand that the court, maybe I misunderstood the court the other day, but I think the court had indicated it was the court's understanding or assumption that um, the Arbery family is giving up seats uh, in the public gallery so that these gentlemen may be present. With all due respect, Your Honor, the seats in the public gallery of a courtroom are not like courtside seats at a Lakers game. Thank you for watching. Please be sure to visit us at rawstory.com. And if you'd like to see more of the Raw Report, please like and subscribe. And join others who like their news raw too.